Hello guys, welcome back to yet another Q&A episode. If you guys are new to this channel, we try to do Q&A sessions every Sunday. So if you like our work and if you find it useful for you guys, then make sure to smash the like button and also consider subscribing to our channel. Now let's not waste much of time. We'll directly take the questions. So the first question is from Gaming GS Gaming, who is asking about Oxygen OS 15 release for OnePlus 9. See, OnePlus 9 won't be receiving Oxygen OS 15. OnePlus 9 will get the last update of Oxygen OS 14.1. Then Harsh is asking about which is better, Moto Edge 50 Pro or Moto edge 50 see moto edge 50 i don't have moto edge 50 pro i won't recommend due to the bad software updates though the device is quite good but the software support is very bad then gshot is asking about whether Nord 3 will get the new animation engine because Nord 4 has those animation engines so mostly yes Nord 3 will also get the new animation engine but still we cannot guarantee about it mohammed is asking me to explain the graphic settings in game centers in oxygen os 14.1 while playing game see i generally don't make any kind of changes in the graphic settings like the gpu or the sensitivity what oneplus have given in the gaming dashboard because i do have my personal sensitivity in bgmi and i don't want to mess around with that anvay bhai namaskar aapka question hai oneplus 12 se related jisme version aaya hua hai .830 jo ki 14.1 hai but version mein 14 mention kar raha hai so aapko ai features ke bare mein janna hai so ai features jo hame nord 4 mein dekhne ko mil rahe hain wo mostly with next update ya oxygen os 15 ke update ke sath hame oneplus 12 mein dekhne ko mil jaye then prajwal is asking about 14.1 update for oneplus 10 pro and the new animation engine and other AI features like Eraser tool. It's a pro version so mostly this device should get all these features along with Oxygen OS 14.1. Then Rajiv is asking when the battery is restricted to 80% for OnePlus 12, it doesn't stop charging if we charge using the wireless charger. See it is not required actually because using wireless charging it doesn't charge the device with this max limit. So obviously battery health will not be affected much. That's the reason they have only set the restrictions to the wired charge. Then Kuldeep is asking does OnePlus Nord 4 have an animation engine? Yes it do have and Nord 3 will mostly get but it all depends as I said earlier we are not sure whether that device will get or not but there are possibilities because Nord 4 has that. Greasy is asking about Android 15 and OnePlus Nord CE series. CE series will get quite late so don't expect uh, you know these devices will get Android 15 or Oxygen OS 15 soon. Then Nikhil is saying uh, bye I hope you are doing well. Yes brother thank you so much for asking i hope even you and your family is doing well why i have a problem with dynamic island notification problem in spotify when i long press it doesn't work and also the home find button of apps are not working at all see these dynamic stuff no just ignore it for few days because once oxygen os 15 comes we'll have better implementation of dynamic island so currently just ignore it and they have recently added with spotify so i'm hoping it's in beta stage then abhineshik says hi brother how hope you are doing fine yes brother and thank you so much for asking why no one is talking about the fps drop in bgmi in Nord 3. See, it's not only with Nord 3, even OnePlus 12 drops the FPS, even it heats up and the Nord 3 is a device which heats up quite more compared to other OnePlus smartphones. That issue mostly won't be fixed with Oxygen S 14.1 but if this device gets 15, there are chances like you know 10 to 20 percent chances are there the gaming experience will improve. And Nord 3 will get new engine, we are hoping to get because Nord 4 has this new animation engine. Krishna is asking us to make custom ROM videos on 11R. See Krishna nowadays not everyone is interested in custom ROMs and there are no downgrade tools or unbreak tools so if anything goes wrong we will be held responsible that's the reason we have stopped the custom room video then glitter says i'm a huge fan of yours are we are not fans we are just a small family brother why oneplus 11r is not getting ai features and ai razor please answer mostly that device will also get don't worry with 14.1 many devices are still pending to receive ai features then studio 2138 says when oneplus not ce light get the new oxygen os 14.1 animation engine i doubt that device will get i mean the ce series but for 14.1 can be expected anytime soon. Vivo Vijan says, Hello brother, how are you? Is there any release date regarding Android 15 or Oxygen OS 15? First of all, brother, I'm doing really good. And about Oxygen OS 15, so closed beta testing is starting from this week. The internal news, what we have. Then Anand Tony says, Hello brother, how are you? I'm doing good, brother. Thank you so much. Suggest me some best matte screen guard for OnePlus 12. See, recently I applied a matte finishing screen guard on my OnePlus 12. And I exactly don't know the name because I went to one of the local store and one of my friend is running that local store. I'll ask the name and keep you guys posted in the comment section. So just give me some time. I'll ask him an update. And guys, I'm ignoring those questions which are repeated like 11 hour AI uh, features and all these things because I've already answered them. Charanjit is asking when will OnePlus 12 R get AI features which are available on Nord 4. So we are expecting AI features on OnePlus 12 R within this month. Akshat Mehta about your low scores in Geek Benchmark application and Tutu Benchmark. I'll need to once again test it on my Nord CE4 and I'll reply you in this comment itself. Then we have next question from Mohammed who is saying shall I update OnePlus 12 to the latest build or wait for the next update? Wait for the next update and you can check out what all issues we have faced on OnePlus 12 after this latest
latest update we have already done a review video then sovic has a question related to vonr why oneplus is not providing i have also mentioned in my previous video i'm not sure exact reason i need to get in touch with oneplus officials why they are not providing even when the hardware is capable of i tried doing some research but wasn't able to find out any answer related to this then bully not ce4 we are exactly not sure about the oxygen os 14.1 but oneplus is about to push this update for a couple of devices stay tuned i'll keep you guys updated because currently we don't have any etr related to that shubham we won't be getting such features on ce series like the uh, animation engine and the ai features which oneplus nord 4 has as if currently there are no fixes you know uh, related to this frame drop what we see on oneplus smartphones let's wait for oxygen os 15 hopefully oxygen os 15 should fix that issue after that new gpu technology gets implemented rn is asking about which one is better a uh, oneplus nord 4 or realme gt 60 See, I have not used Realme GT60. You can just check out other videos. You'll get better idea about it. Sanjay is asking, is OnePlus 12 are still worthy at this point in time or we can go with other brands? See, OnePlus 12 are is a good device with no doubt. It all depends what are your preferences. If you're looking for performance centric, then go with iQOO. And if you want clean software, then there are phones from nothing else. Then Puneet has two questions. First of all, Puneet, thank you so much for asking. I'm really doing good. Your question is layered to when can we expect features like AI summary and uh, AI speak, etc. on OnePlus 12. OnePlus 12, 99% with next update, we might get to see these features. About Oxygen OS 15 beta updates, see beta will take time, close beta testing will be starting this week as per the internal news what we have. Shady, I'm doing really good, thank you so much. Uh, your question is layer to battery drain on OnePlus 12 after the recent update and when it's going to fix. See, we cannot say about the fixes. Yes, this update do have some issues related to battery drain and throttling. Throttling was also seen more on OnePlus 12. Let's wait for next update. I'll keep you guys posted if anything gets improved. Lucifer, mostly yes, uh, this month we might get to see 14.1 for uh, OnePlus Nord 3. Animation engines we are expecting because OnePlus Nord 4 has the animation engine, but slight doubt is there because that device heats up much and animations will drain more battery and we might also see more heating issues. Then Umer is very disappointed from us because I have never read his comment. Brother, first of all, I'm really sorry and uh, you know whatever comment appears on the screen or the community post I do reply even I am a human being I might have missed out but your question is is there any chance of getting Oxygen OS 15 on OnePlus 9 no OnePlus 9 will not get Oxygen OS 15 Oxygen OS 14.1 will be the last one and motivational mind I need to check out the current applications of Color OS like the messaging app and the contact app if you have the links you can share me on telegram I'll cross check why they are not getting installed Stromy OnePlus 11 might take some time to receive Oxygen OS 15 uh, expecting in the month of October or November. Improviser says, Hi, bye, love your videos. Thank you so much, brother. When can we expect Oxygen OS 15 beta? Closed beta will be starting uh, this week and open beta mostly next month or this month end we might get to see initial builds. I mean the first build. And I'm noticing a degradation in the camera of OnePlus 11 and the camera is not up to mark and can you check an update? I think recently I made a video on OnePlus 11. I did mention about the camera issues on OnePlus 11. I'll still check. Uh, OnePlus long term review is pending mostly in this week I'll release that uh, review video MJ I'm really doubtful whether Nord CE 4 series will get the new animation engine then Bijoy is asking Amazon independent sale is coming give a suggestion please is OnePlus Nord 4 A256 is worth buying at 29,000 or should I wait for the price drop like previous year Nord 3 because Nord 4 has the same thermal issues like Nord 3 no like Nord 3 Nord 4 doesn't have that much of thermal issues thermal issues generally is available on every OnePlus smartphone and just wait before 15th August, I have many videos planned comparing Nord 4 with other smartphones. Crafting, we are expecting at least on the Nord series like the 3 and 4, we are expecting this uh, Gaussian blur effect. Blue Smart, it's not possible to downgrade OnePlus smartphones to an older security patch nowadays. Then Tired says, uh, My friend having IQ showing 5G plus, why not OnePlus? Seriously, even I don't have this answer. As I replied one of the comments, I need to get in touch with OnePlus officials regarding this thing. But by next QA, I'll keep you guys posted about it. Morgan is asking about the expected launch of Buds Pro 3 and I've just now purchased OnePlus Buds Pro 2 was that the right decision see OnePlus Buds Pro 2 are really good earbuds so you don't have to regret buying them you can easily use them for another two years yes Rowan battery backup issues are seen on almost every OnePlus smartphone after the June update so let's wait for OnePlus to fix it Benny we are expecting 14.1 this month for OnePlus 10 Pro AJ is asking which app do I use to monitor FPS GPU CPU and skin temperature of the device so I use Tacostat application I've also made a video on that I'll leave that video in the description below and guys almost five to six comments are already replied from a team member and the last question is from ex9695 about oxygen os 15 beta cup start over the 
देखो बीटा लाइक ओपन बीटा इस मंथ के एंड में पॉसिबिलिटीज है स्टार्ट हो रहेगी बट क्लोज बीटा इस वीक में स्टार्ट हो जाएगा सो गाइज दीज आर ऑल दी क्वेश्चन विच यू गाइज आंसर्स ऑन द कम्युनिट बॉस दिस इज अ फ्रेंड अशोक साइनिंग आउट सी यू गाइज इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो Go, go, go.